Welcome to a drawing proportions tutorial. We'll show you how to measure proportions using the app. This functionality is available in all project types and can be used in the reference and drawing screens. To explain it better, let's use a grid. Place the main unit at the length of one of the squares. To place an additional unit, tap the ruler icon at the top. As you can see, if you place the main unit at the length of a square, the extra unit will measure one. If you place the extra unit at two squares it will measure two. Changing the length of the main unit affects the proportion of the extra unit. Here, a main unit measuring two squares and an extra unit measuring one reads as 0.5. You can measure proportions at any angle. You can place up to five additional units. To delete them, tap the extra units and choose the trash can icon. If the unit measurements are too exact for you, Try to change the style to rounded fractions in the settings screen. You can also change the drawing style of the units. In portraits and figure drawings, keeping proportions helps with idealized measurements. Common ones are separating the middle of the face into thirds, from the start of the hairline to the bottom of the chin. Another one is keeping the width of the face measuring 5 eyes. 